on the Lord. Be of good courage. And he shall strengthen thy heart. Wait, I say, on the Lord. Amen. The other day I was watching a show. And the show, as it was going off, it, the, the, the uh, commercial came on and said, we'll be right back. Stay here. I'm coming to tell the people of God on today, God will be right back. So don't go nowhere on today. Stay in the house of God. Don't leave God now because Jesus is soon to return. God has done so many things for us. All we got to do is just keep doing what God has called us to do on today. We got to understand that God brought us through one trial. He'll bring us through another one. That now the, that the time that we are living in now, what's happening is the devil is trying to mess with our faith. But I'm telling you all tonight, don't go nowhere. Jesus is coming back to see about us. Don't give in now. Don't give up now. Hold on to what God has already done. If you can't hold on to nothing else, hold on to what he's already done until he do something else for you all today. Don't give up on God now. This is the time for us to hold on. I'm telling you now, the things that we are going through now, the devil is trying to shake our faith. He's trying to move us. Yes, we don't see God doing many things down through the years, but now, this time that we're living in, we're seeing everything going on. But God is saying, don't let this change your mind about me on today. Because if I save you, I'm saving you to keep you. So God can keep those that want to be kept. The Bible lets us know if we keep our mind stayed on him, he will keep us in perfect peace. Don't let the devil disturb your peace. Give him a hand on today. Let him know that God has given you the power to spread upon the suffering of the day. In other words, God gave you the power to put the devil in his place. Woo! You tell the devil yes, when to get on. You tell the devil where to go. You the one got the power on tonight. Right. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hold on to your faith. Because this is what the devil is trying to mess with now. He's not messing us with our cars and our homes, clothes and all those things. He just wants us to get out of the ark of safety. So I'm telling you all tonight, don't you do it. Jesus said I'm coming right back. Keep doing what he told you to do. Get out there and witness. Witness like he told us. Get out there and spread the word like he told us to spread the word. Get out there and do what we are supposed to do. Don't you do it. Don't you dare look back. Let us not be like Lot's wife on tonight. Let us not look about how good it would have been if we would have stayed back there in the old world. But the devil is alive. Because God has already given us the night. He didn't give us the spirit of fear, but a power, love, and a sign, man. And I'm going to get ready to take my seat. But I want to encourage my brothers and my sisters on today. Yes, it's weary now. This thing is getting tiresome now because again, the devil is trying to wear out the most high on today. But we got to get together. We got to bind together. We got to pray together. We got to love together. We got to worship together. When your brother's down, you lift him up. When your sister's down, you lift them up. We're in this thing together. We do it better. Yeah. Oh. 